We are once again checking out the scary videos. Make sure to smash. Oh subscribe if you're brand new. Okay. New channel. Let's get it. The Magnolia Hotel. Oh the Magnolia Hotel in Seguin, Texas is said to be extremely haunted by multiple ghosts. The hotel multiple. was built in 1840, and over its 180 year history, many people have passed away inside its walls. Bro, this is already giving me the creeps. Some even taking their own lives. Damn. The current owners of the hotel, Jim and Aaron Getty, claim to have experienced intense paranormal activity while living there, and many of the hotel guests have captured ghostly images of spirits that haunt the Damn. hotel. Damn. Yo, One that's a forehead. One of the most spirits in the hotel is said to be that of a 12-year-old girl named Emma. Oddly enough, Emma never even stayed in the Magnolia Hotel. But yeah, are you more scared of like kids ghosts or like older woman ghosts? Uh, well, what's more scary? The man who violently took her life did live there. In 1874, a man named Wilhelm Faust horribly ended little Emma's life using Damn. an axe. Bro. Wilhelm was still staying at the Magnolia Hotel when he was caught and executed for his crime. It is Damn, said bro. that both That's... the angry spirit of Wilhelm and the gentle child ghost Emma are both forever trapped inside the Magnolia Hotel. Paranormal oh, yeah. investigators Colin and Peyton from the YouTube channel The Paranormal Files travel to the Magnolia Hotel to do an investigation at the allegedly haunted inn. They experience something truly bizarre. Uh, uh, yeah, truly bizarre, bro. Bro, turn on the lights, dog. Turn on the. Yeah, let me just make sure. It's really send that thing likes to whistle in here. Oh my god. Bro. Dude, this one firework. Damn, dude. <laughs> Yo, dude. Turn on the lights! Tur Turn on the lights! Uh, uh, eh, 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 eh. Whoa! Whoa! That's a gun. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Two rounds fired. Coming from literally right there. They it's hear only the coming. unexplained sounds of knocking and possible gunfire while exploring the hotel rooms. However, it's what they didn't hear at the time that is absolutely it. chilling. Bro, the way she turned her head that frequently. Sit down for a second, too, before we go to the unfinished part. That's friendly. That's friendly. Kill the lights. Yo, bro, this guys, is giving me the creeps. I know it's kind of boring. Guys, I know. I know it's kind of guys, I know. The voice of what sounds like a young girl can be heard <laughs> saying the eerie word, mommy. Love now, it. if that wasn't creepy enough, the owners of the Magnolia Hotel actually caught what they believe to be the same young girl, little Emma, on one of their static cameras. The camera Damn. is set up in the room where the ghost of Emma has reportedly been seen and heard the most. They call it the quote, children's room. Mm -hmm. One day they leave a bunch of balls and toys for Emma to play with. And then this happens. Okay, guys, I cannot pull a weapon out because just realized it's a kid's ghost. So yeah, it's kind of, okay. You know, that, that do be kind of rolling. It do be kind of rolling. But what's that? What's that? I'm looking at that. That's also moving. See, oh, oh, hey, 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 yo, what? <laughs> yeah, there was something that walked over, right? God damn. But Balls on the floor mysteriously seem to just start rolling around on their own. But what's most bizarre about this footage is the strange shadow figure that yeah. follows right after the unexplained movement. Could it be that the spirit of little Emma... But, but don't they have a policy to not show up on camera? I'm kind of confused. With the toys? Is the Magnolia Hotel haunted by the ghosts of the people who lost their lives Maybe. inside its walls? Let me know what you think down in the comments. Yo, that zoom in, my guy. Colin and Peyton's entire investigation crazy, over dude. on the YouTube channel, The Paranormal Files. And you can find more spooky evidence and photos over on the Magnolia Snap. Hotel's Facebook page. Viewer videos. In this next segment, I'm very happy to feature some extremely creepy videos that were sent to me directly via email by Nukes Top 5 viewers. First up, this video was sent in by Dex, who claims that one of his friends has been going on apartment viewings in the hopes of finding a new place to live. His friend recorded one of the empty apartments so he could look back at the footage later to help him decide. When he reviews his footage, he is shocked by what he finds. Okay, I'm hyped, bro. I'm hyped. 
to see this. Okay, daytime, not too bad then, right? Not too bad. But yo, why you move in your camera? Like, oh, hey, you. bro. Daytime is kind of bad. Kind of bad, dog. Yo, that, oh, he, oh, yo, why are you moving that quick? Slow down. Oh, 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 my, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Did you see it? Oh my God. While recording, Dex's friend thinks he sees something Dude. out of the corner of his eye. <laughs> Bro, my God. A dark shadow-like figure standing at the end of the hallway. But when he pans back, nothing there. Yeah. So did Dex's friend capture a ghost on Yo, daytime, daytimes do be kind of scary. Emma, though, and could it be lie. that the apartment is empty for a reason? I leave it up to you to decide. This next video was emailed to me Yo, by Connor. CG, CGI or what? From Corpus Hots? Christi, Texas. In his email, he explains that his cousin is awakened in the middle of the night when a stranger suddenly approaches his ring doorbell. The doorbell camera uh, records as things take a very creepy turn. Uh-oh, uh, yo, let me get my big shoddy dog. I cannot do this after the last episode. I can't. Just do it once, twice, bro. That's it. Oh, hey, oh. guys. I oh swear to you, in all my life, I swear I mean you no harm. No, please, I mean you no harm. Doggy. Oh, can, can you please come outside and let me know I'm alive? I don't I don't know what's going on. No, God. I'm gonna live. I'm gonna live. Yo, what's happening? Because someone's in here. Yo, what's happening? God, I feel like... Please come outside. I'm having a feeling that somebody will come up here or show up here. Please. Ah, oh, no, I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Why you say that? Yeah, there's something that happened before, right? Something probably happened. Why ain't y'all coming outside me? I just want to fire once, okay? Just once, okay? Bah! Just, just wanted to make sure, like, cause, well, hey, 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 yo, something kind of, I don't know. I felt like yo, one sec, something for. He's gonna recap either way, but I felt like something just moved. Hey, help. Please? Help? Something happening to him or what? The man who rang the doorbell is odd and erratic as he pleads for them to open the door and let him inside. Understandably, they don't answer the door. And the man eventually walks away defeated, loudly yelling, I'm not dead. Yeah. Connor's cousin has no idea what happened to the man. And the scary event remains a mystery. But I, I, I think he's high. He's on drugs or alcohol. Yes, yeah, some chemical substances were probably involved. Yeah, if you yeah, see yeah. a video that you think would be perfect for the top Tom. Visits to the funeral home. Chinese ghost hunter and popular live streamer Xiao Long is back with another scary adventure at a creepy abandoned funeral Yo, home in Xinjiang City, China. Local legend says that restless souls unable to move on after their deaths have found themselves trapped inside the funeral home eternally doomed to haunt the lonely abandoned building forever. Locals say the home is cursed. <laughs> but as always, none of that stops our boy Xiao Long. He travels to the abandoned funeral home completely alone. Completely as he's alone? he's exploring outside the building, he stumbles upon an old abandoned hearse that was once used to transport bodies. Damn. What happens next is truly bizarre. Truly bizarre? Okay, not shocking. It's not shocking, but it's bizarre. Oh, damn, son. Is it? Oh, snap. Bro, okay, not. Yo, oh, oh, eh, 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 eh. Wow, wow. Oh, my God. Yo, he cried. Yo, but uh, I, 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 yo, bro. I gotta chill. I gotta chill. Bro, <laughs> I felt like there was someone here. You see my mouse there? Because it felt that way. <laughs> Xiaolong fans love the creepy live stream and demand that he return to the haunted funeral home for yet another visit. Another? As always, he broadcasts his investigation live as he explores a different area of the building. As you might suspect, it did not. Uh, yeah, he, uh, yeah, 
It did not go. Your mirrors. I don't like mirrors. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hey, I'm oh my my goodness. Oh snap. Something here? Oh snap. Damn. 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 Ah! 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 Oh. Bro, yo, I almost fell. I almost fell, dude. I all oh, okay, bro. Like that's nothing. That's probably gravity, you know. <laughs> but still scary, though. That's still scary. Man. Something fell out from him. Yeah, he. Oh my god, yo, he's running, dude. He's running. Yeah, bro, run, 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 run. When he discovers that the area... My guy pressed R2 and he held that motherfucker crazy, dude. Yeah, hold R2, bro. Run, just run. It was actually Press used X. to store human Spam bodies. It, Even though he's starting to freak out a bit, he returns to the crematorium carrying what he says is a protective amulet. He still he came in? Oven, and that's when he sees something absolutely horrifying oh my okay now the, we gotta have both we gotta have both <laughs> oh snap oh my god oh my god oh my yo is that something oh snap oh shit oh shit oh no oh no 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 i gotta hold the shotgun bro. oh damn, damn. my god oh snap dude i i'm done dude this is scary yeah, bro. Shotgun. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm start praying, dog. I'm gonna start praying. The pill face seems to rise up through the oven's air vent and then disappears back into the darkness. Damn. 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 I'm getting chills right now. Damn. Yo, what time are you watching this video? Let me know. Currently, I'm recording at 6 30 p.m. Could this be one of the souls that are said to be trapped inside the funeral home? I leave it to you to decide. That slow you can ascent. Watch this entire exploration and many more creepy videos. Yo, I, okay, listen. I have seen not many videos, but I have seen plenty so far, and I would say that this one genuinely feels legit, right? Because uh, at least he was truly scared. That it, it felt that way. Maybe he's a great actor. Maybe he's a Hollywood actor. But it genuinely feels like that he was scared. Videos over um, on Xiaolong's YouTube channel. And that makes it a lot more Xiaolong. scary. Yeah, that makes it a Meanwhile, lot more scary. On TikTok. TikTok user TikTok? Michael says that he started experiencing terrifying paranormal activity in his home after he played around with a Ouija board at a friend's house. He says that he believes that he might have accidentally summoned a demonic entity that followed him home. Accidentally, in an dog. To Don't play with that. And explain what's been going on. He's interrupted by something very creepy. Now, I'm personally not too aware with Ouija boards, but from what I'm hearing, just don't F around with it. Any of you ever touch that? If you did, let me know your experience. Be honest, share your experience. Was it a baloney or did you see something or did something happen or did something not happen? Let me know. So if I've you had, had experience. Weird something happening lately and I, I can't. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, I, I need something. I need something. Yeah, hands won't do anything, Hello? dog. A child's voice can be heard, yet Michael claims he has no children. Yeah. He says he doesn't know where the mysterious voice could have possibly come from. So Michael decides to set up static cameras all around his home in the hopes of capturing more proof of the paranormal activity that has been terrorizing him. When he looks back at the footage from his kitchen camera, he's shocked. Oh snap. Okay, there's a cat. Yeah, okay, cat got scared for some reason. Two cats? Okay. They're looking at oh snap. Oh my god guys. I gotta put the weapon down. You got two cats there Can be dangerous. Oh my god But the cats aren't too scared by the looks cuz they they're not like They're a little bit, but they're not scared to the point where they're Michael running away his from girlfriend it, right? Heather decide to do another <laughs> session this time to try to get answers as to what is going on but Things take a terrifying turn. Oh no, I don't hear him say terrifying all the time, so this might be crazy. E? R. 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 E. Here? Uh oh. Here. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Come back, come back, come back. Oh my god, I don't want to just. I'm freaked out now. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, Bro, oh, the, the fact that this video is a TikTok and he has put the same video but full screen and blurred it, blurred it out. You saw when she got up and here there was a shadow. I freaked out. But it's from this video. It's blurred out. Oh snap. They're going. Oh, oh, oh. oh it, it, it. Yo, I'm. Okay, no, 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 no. I can do this. I'm a stud muffin. I'm a stud. Giga chance, rise up, rise up, rise up, rise up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Bro, run, run, Something run! Something violently crashes to the ground right next to Heather, and then they both hear a loud sound coming from upstairs. When they look up the staircase, someone or something that they can't see comes charging down the stairs at them. So is Michael's house haunted by a demonic entity? Drop your thoughts down in the Yo, I'm a, I'm a giga chat. I can't. Comment. <laughs> yeah, man. God damn, dude. Think that user Roche Bananas is working the night shift as a security guard on a reservation in Saskatchewan, Canada. Oh, she snake, and her co-worker Canada? see something very strange. When we work night security 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. and we see something coming at us at midnight. Who is it? Really? Yo, what's that? Is that like a shadow? <laughs> TikTok user Roche Bananas claims she has no idea what she recorded that night and is pretty spooked by the creepy encounter. Yeah. Many concerned TikTok viewers believe that it could be anything from a skinwalker. Okay, no, there's a shadow. You see that shadow because there's a light source here and you see that shadow. So it's not a sh uh, I mean, this is a shadow, but this is actually someone. It's uh, either a person or an animal. Looks to be a person though. Uh, you mean to Bigfoot to a ghost, but what do you think it is? is Seems it like a person. Or is it all just an elaborate? Y you, they can easily fake it. It might be their friend, right? They're like, yeah, man, just go there. We're going to record. We're going to do a TikTok video. Go there. Just walk around, but do not come on the surface, on the road. Just stay in the, on the, on the grass and easy video. Hoax. You decide. If real, the eternal Daphne bride. Spooky, for sure. All of the residents of Culiacan in Sinaloa, Mexico know of the story of Lupita, the eternal uh -oh. bride. The story. Okay, man, do not get married. Okay, I'll just that say Back in the early 1950s, a young woman named Lupita was engaged to be married to her childhood sweetheart, Jesus. The bride to be and her fiance were both friends with a man named Ernesto, who was hopelessly in love with Lupita. But Lupita had no romantic interest at all in Ernesto. Ernesto Damn. was driven mad by his jealousy, and on the wedding day, he took the life of Lupita's husband-to-be as she watched on in horror. Ernesto Damn. then took his own life. Damn. Lupita was so traumatized by the event that she never recovered and just completely lost touch with reality. Every Sunday for the next 30 years, Lupita would dress in her wedding gown and walk to Bro. the church cathedral in town. After her death in 1982, she was buried and it is said that she aimlessly roams the cemetery grounds, still in her wedding dress, to this day. Snap. A paranormal investigator from Mexico who happens to share the name Ernesto from the YouTube channel Zona Paranormal. Okay, it's so on the fact that this is Mexico and Spanish. Yeah, that's uh, gonna be next level. Vera Cruz is joined by his friends and fellow investigators El Payaso de la Toledo and Lorena Jacobo. Together they explore the cemetery late at night. They hear and on top, it's a cemetery. Gonna be next level. Okay. sounds all around them, and then this happens. Oh, oh, oh! Hey, hey. Then this happens. Hey. Oh my God. Muéstrate, Lupita. Show yourself. Pido que te muestres. I'm asking you to show yourself. Ya I already vi. saw you. Bro, who says that? Ya jalaste energía. You taken some energy? Oh, wait. Oh my, cierto, yo me llamo Ernest. oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, he saw. <laughs> Bro, I thought for a second he was not scared because, you know, it came out, right? And I was like, okay, oh my god. And then he realizes, then I got a lot more scared because, you know, my god, yeah, reaction timing. He realized after the fact. And now I'm scared. Yeah, yeah, man. She leaned. My name is Ernesto. Like the man who killed. Bro, why would you say that? I have the same name as him, Ernesto. Like the, the guy who killed her husband to be. Bro, why would you say that? Damn. 
Are you angry okay, because I don't fit in there? <laughs> 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 Yo, my guy, you might be a stud donut. You gotta have, stop taking too many calories in, okay? Stop in taking them calories. <laughs> I'll see if I can fit in there. Hola, hey, oh, oh, hey, oh, mira, 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 the bucket, wait, I'm coming, you really don't fit in there, <laughs> something is pulling my back, here it comes, damn, damn, something pulled my backpack, Oh, Something pulled my backpack again. Let's go to the grave. She's mad at me. No way, dude. Something pulled my backpack. Peso. It came inside that grave. Let's go to her grave. Ernesto is broadcasting live on Facebook when he spots someone appear and disappear near one of the graves. They hurry over to investigate, but Ernesto gets stuck in between two tombs. In a shocking turn, Ernesto feels someone or something pulling him back. Your cap or facts? And then, did you see it? Oh, it oh, right oh, behind oh, oh. Payaso, another mysterious apparition can be seen lurking behind the tomb. Now again, Sam. this is a live stream broadcast. The figure is spotted by the viewing audience, but the two investigators are completely unaware of what they've just captured. They continue their exploration. I'll use the other flashlight. Oh snap, dude, flashlight's bad. She walked in front of her. I caught her, I caught her. <laughs> Yo, they, they are so happy. I caught her. Love, dude. My knee, dude. My knee. Lore. Let's see Laura. Let's find her. She should be at the entry. Let's find her, she said. Are you still. Okay, now I don't feel that much scared because these homies are not scared, right? So I don't feel scared now. We saw something here. Sí, eh, estás mandando, estás en vivo todavía. Ahí está Lorena y está en vivo, señores. There's Lorena and she's live streaming. What we saw was the novia. bride. I saw her too. We got her on tape. I'm seeing her too, MD. Es que, es que dicen que they say she may be following me. Yo me llamo como el que mató su because I have the same name as her husband. I got pulled by my backpack. Donde no cabía. Uh, and she pulled my backpack. I'll show you the lore is still is still live streaming. I'm here. Look. The guys see an apparition that appears to be wearing a long white dress. They quickly go to find fellow investigator Lorena, who's broadcasting her own live stream in a different area of the cemetery. She explains that she too saw the figure of what appeared to be Lupita, the lonely bride. Now, as I mentioned, this stream was live. So it would be very hard to fake. Damn. What? what do you think? Let me know. I don't know. Like, what are your thoughts? It's definitely a good one. But click on this video on the screen. I'm telling you, we've been reacting. Uh, click on it. Subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.